And the devil says, I got to break them up. I got to break them up. I got to sow discord. It's an abomination. It is an abomination to that person that sows discord among the brethren. Be careful when you are an agent. I'm not saying you the devil, but when you are an agent of the devil to sow discord. That's how the devil will use you to, to bring division and discord because the devil does not want us to come into an agreement. Because agreement is the power of life. Whenever you come in agreement with the Word of God, your life becomes powerful. When you actually believe what you are reading and you come in agreement with what God says in His Word, nobody can talk you out of your faith because I believe it and I speak it. I cannot speak what I don't believe because I am confused when I believe one thing and I say something else. But when you really believe that he is the king of kings and he's the Lord of lords and he's a way maker and he's a savior and he's a healer and he's my peace, he's my joy. Who can talk you out of that? The devil becomes angry when you come in agreement with his word.